our applied algebra problem number nine we are looking for d which is the dimension of a post which we can see right here this dimension of a post it's probably cylindrical it's a so it's probably a, cylind a cylindrical column to hold up some portion of a building all right so we're solving for a numerical a answer we need to separate D from this equation here and we have E we have L we have S we're gonna solve for so we're gonna solve for D so the first thing we do is we write the equation out as it is so that's S equals 3 E D squared over 10 L squared first thing we can do is multiply both sides by 10 L squared to get rid of 10 L squared on the right side. So this leads our equation to 10 L squared times S equals 3 E D squared. Then we'll divide both sides by 3 E to get the D squared by itself. So the threes cancel out on the right side. The E's cancel out on the right side and we're left with 10 L squared times S over 3 E equals D squared. Finally, take the square root of both sides. We end up with D equals the square root of 10 L squared S over 3 E. All right, and now all we need to do is plug in numbers. So S is 420, L is 96, I believe, yep, 3, and then times 1,500,000, all right. This all equals 2 from our handy dandy calculator, so let's do 96 squared times 10 times 420 divided by 3, divided by 1,500,000, take the square root of that, and we get 2.93 something, but we need to round up to the nearest whole number, so there we go.